Hello everyone, I am Dr. Padmapani Tribhuvan. In this video, I am going to discuss Depth First Search algorithm in artificial intelligence. Depth First Search always expands the deepest node in the current frontier of the search tree. The search proceeds immediately to the deepest level of the search tree where the nodes have no successors. As those nodes are expanded, they are dropped from the frontier so that the search backs up to the next deepest node that still has unexplored successors. It is an informed search or it is also called as blind search algorithm. It uses LIFOQ that is the stack data structure. A LIFOQ or a stack data structure means that the most recently generated node is chosen for expansion. This must be the deepest unexpanded node because it is one deeper than its parent which in turn was the deepest unexpanded node when it was selected. Now let us try to solve this problem by DFS. Consider this graph. In this graph, A is initial state. and a G is a goal state. The algorithm will start with node A. It will use LIFOQ that is stack data structure. Then here we will write the visited nodes. First node A will be added to the tag. It is not a goal state so it will be explored further. There are three nodes adjacent to A, node B, node C and node D. Out of these three nodes, any one node will be considered and it will be expanded further to reach to the deepest level. So let us select node B. So node B will be added to the stack as it is not a goal state. Then it will be expanded further and it will be added to visited nodes. Uh, from node B there are two different paths. One is to node E and another one is to node C. Let us select node E. So node E will be added to the stack and it will be expanded as it is not a goal state and it will be added to the visited list. Node E has only two adjacent nodes, node F and node G. Let us select node F. F is not a goal state so it will be added to the stack, it will be expanded and it will be added to visited list. Now note that there is only one adjacent node to node F which is node E. and Node E is already visited, so now node F is completely expanded and that means we have reached to the deepest level and it does not have any successor. Now we will remove it from the stack. Now on the top of the stack we have node E. So now we will check for the unexpanded or unexplored node which is adjacent to node E. So node G is there which is unexplored. So it will be added to the stack. Now G is a goal state. That means we got the path from node A to node G by using DFS algorithm. Please note here that you may get some other path from node A to node G using DFS depending upon which branch you are exploring to deepest level. DFS is a neither complete nor optimal. But as compared to the BFS algorithm that is breadth first search algorithm, it uses less memory. Depth limited search algorithm and iterative deepening depth first search algorithm are extensions of DFS algorithm. We will discuss this algorithm in next video. It will be uploaded soon. Till then, being passionate learner, keep learning. Thank you.